Hello everyone, I am Tasneem. Welcome to my channel, The Social Wizard. So, in today's video, I am going to talk about the Google Spreadsheet or the Google Excel Sheet. So, without any further delay, let's start the video. So, Google Excel Sheet is a service provided by the Google so that you don't have to download or install the Excel in your computer uh, rather than you are going to using the Excel Sheets via online and um, you can share your Excel Sheet, edit your Excel Sheet online, you can download your Excel Sheet for using it offline for your, uh, for, for, for your using it in future and you can also collaborate your work with your friends and other uh, team members. So it is basically very much easier uh, to use and it, it is very much uh, uh, useful for this online era. So to uh, open the Google Excel sheet, you have to go to the Google Chrome and click here the Google Apps. And after scrolling down, you will find the Google Sheets option. Go to the Google Sheet. Then you will find some template. There is a template gallery. You can choose any kind of template from here according to your topic. Like if you want to do any kind of to-do list, then you can select here. For annual budget, you can select here. You can make calendars. You can make schedule of, for your classes or for your uh, workings throughout your day. So there is a travel description, trip plans, wedding plans, also work and points. So different, different templates here you can easily use these templates okay so i'm not going to use these templates uh, and for making a new spreadsheet uh, or for a blank new sh new spreadsheet um, you are going to work you have to press here the blank then a new spreadsheet has been opened so these are the columns column a b c d and till maybe yeah z so there are 26 column in total and there are some rows you can add rows after this rows as well but there are enough rows to use okay so to start like uh, if you want to uh, write your monthly expenses so i'm going to um, uh, add a header for this so first uh, I'm going to uh, select this cell then press the shift then select all these five six seven eight cells and then here is the option that is click is uh, march cells then click here and your cell will be marched and it will now count it as one cell the five cell will be counted as one cell and you can write anything here so i'm going to write like monthly budget or um, uh, or daily expenses okay now i'm going to place it at the middle so here is the option place it at the center then select the writings make it bold then you can also uh, click here and just pull down and your cell will be a bit larger so i'm going to make the font size bigger like 14 the area is perfect then you can change the text color from here the a i'm going to okay i'm going to first check the background color so this is the option for the background color i'm going to choose a background sweet background color then i'm going to change the text color as white okay now it's looking cool so uh, you can now put any information in these cells and do some calculation as well so now first i'm going to uh, write here some thing like uh, something like item then here cost oh 
okay item and cost and so first i'm going to okay you can also color these cells as well if you want so then i'm going to color these cells select this and give a sweet color okay so first i'm going to place the item like food the cost is like 150 then transport transportation cost maybe 120 then shopping maybe 1500 then maybe personal care Okay, so I have listed some items and their costs as well. So if you uh, want to calculate the cost, so I'm going to place a cell total and calculate the cost. You don't have to actually calculate the cost by hand. You can uh, do some summation or subtraction using the Excel sheet. So I'm going to select. So here I want to show the total amount. So select here. Then then press the shift button from your keyboard and select until the item you want to calculate so i have select this and my uh, result will be shown here and um, all the expenses will be calculated so here is the option for calculating so click here and you will find an option at the first that is sum okay so the sum is uh, 2770 okay I made a mistake this should be here so I'm going to show you again so just cut it so I want to calculate all of those expenses then select all the expenses then just click sum and the result will be shown in the in the next cell so this is how you can calculate easily with your spreadsheet so I'm going to color this all the cells in another color so that it will look good okay so in this way you can simply calculate your cost or calculate anything using the spreadsheet so th here is the uh, name uh, of the spreadsheet that is united spreadsheet so let's rename the name as daily expenses so you, you just have to you just have to click and select uh, and then press the backspace then daily expenses okay okay so it has been renamed and this excel sheet has been uh, saved automatically in your drive if you go to your drive you, you will find the excel sheet in your drive so you don't have to save again work and save again work and save the google will automatically save and store your excel sheet and it will never be lost uh, either you don't delete this one so you can also save your spreadsheet uh, offline so you will um, maybe you you need to view your excel sheet offline so you can make it available for offline or you can also download it so by go to file option and here is the option for download and you will find different different options like you can you can download it as microsoft excel sheet so that you can download and edit in the microsoft excel as well then you can download as an open document you can download as a pdf you can download as a web page as well that is exciting you can download it with different different options so i'm going to download as a pdf so here is the option you can select the paper size 
there are different different paper size like a4 size a3 size b4 size so i am going to select the standard size then you can make it landscape as well as you can make it portrait so i am going to making it the landscape then there are different different options okay then all you have to do you have to just click the export so the pdf is downloading yeah my pdf has been downloaded so i am going to click here and uh, it will be yeah so this is the pdf as you can see you can print your pdf as well from here okay so this is how um, excel sheet is very easy with google so you can try this google uh, google excel and let me know in the comment section below is this video helpful for you or not so if my video was helpful please do subscribe my channel and hit the notification bell button so i'll be back with another brand new video see you later